While some have been debating whether the president should be giving speeches during prime time or directly to school children, at least one man in Tempe is hoping the president will stop speaking altogether. Tonight, Cronkite News reporter Mike Pelton has a story of an outspoken pastor and a group that thinks love is the answer. Angry because they say we're trying to take away his freedom of speech. We are not. We're simply practicing our freedom of speech. Clark couldn't stand hearing Anderson's angry words anymore. This was started out of amazement because of the fact that we have a man uh, in our home state, our beautiful state of Arizona, that was preaching for the, hoping for the death of our president. His group, People Against Clergy Who Preach Hate, organized what he calls a love rally, spreading the word through Facebook and gathering outside Pastor Anderson's Faithful Word Baptist Church. It really kind of scared us what this guy was saying, what Pastor Anderson was saying. Many people showed up outside to protest the pastor's hateful words. One woman was turned away when she tried to go inside. He told me I wasn't allowed on the property. Carolyn Laurie said security told her she could only go inside if she dropped her sign. Carolyn says she just wanted to speak to Anderson face to face to talk about what he's preaching. Shows disrespect. You know, I don't care, not just because it's Obama and I'm a black woman. It's just because it's, the, it's the, wrong, the wrong thing to do, especially from the pulpit. This group says this protest isn't a one-time deal. They will continue to show up until there's a change. We're going to be here until the this man over here that calls himself a reverend stops preaching hate. Until then, Clark says he and his supporters will try and preach love. Yeah, peace, brother. In Tempe, Mike Pelton, Cronkite News. We tried contacting Pastor Anderson and the church for comment, but their phone number is disconnected. We also sent an email to the address listed, but it bounced right back. The Love Group has 1,400 members and is planning another rally this upcoming Sunday.